Hello, everybody. Um, this is my unboxing video of my very first fursuit head. Um, the character's name is Piper, and uh, she was made by a very, very, very sweet uh, boy. His name is uh, Liam Joel Wolf. You can find him on Facebook. Um, he's been so great throughout this entire process. He just kept me updated with work in progress pictures. He was very sweet with all my concerns and questions. Um, I adore the kid. I really do. Um, and I do apologize in advance because my voice is, is dying. I'm recovering from a pretty bad cold. And so uh, the first thing I noticed when I picked up uh, the box from the uh, post office is that It's a very lovely, lovely drawing of a uh, pie brain way done on the box, which I will definitely uh, be keeping because that's just honestly super cute. I adore it so much. Uh, I almost squealed in the post office as best as I could with my failing voice. <laughs> so, uh, I'm prepared. Got my newly opened X Acto knife because I was actually just working on making her tail. Um, so this is brand new. Very, very convenient. Um, oh boy. I'm excited. So, there's a bunch of bags in here. And a uh, nice little, what looks to be a letter, so I'm just going to take that off. May or may not read it out loud, we'll see. Tell me what it says. It says just uh, cleaning instructions, which I will definitely keep handy because that is something I'm always very concerned about. So I'm glad that he included that like right in the box. Um, trying to figure out a safety place to put this because I don't quite honestly have a whole lot of room. Just keep that behind me for now. Oh, lovely. It's a bag. What I've always wanted. <laughs> I'm really bad with jokes. I'm, I'm not funny. Taking all the padding out first. I like. I wanna. I wanna save this. Oh my gosh! Here she is. box on the floor. She's honestly got a lot smaller than I thought she'd be, which is great because, like I said, I don't have a whole lot of room. So I was uh, really worried about where I was going to be putting her, but now that I'm seeing that she's like a nice size, I don't quite have to worry about that too much. I'm like super nervous to actually open this. Oh, here we go. There's more bags inside. Oh, they're covering her ears. So, Piper is a, um, a bearded vulture. And the character was actually created by Liam as well, which was super cool. Like, the first time that I, uh, when I was working with him, she was showing me the character. I was just in absolute love. Oh, it's the main. Oh my god. I think I might cry. Prop her up on my knee. I see her eyes and everything through the bag. Alright, ready? Oh! I can't believe she's actually here. Oh, look at her. She's so pretty. Let's have a look at these ears. Because that was something I was really looking forward to seeing how, uh, how he did the ears. And then he sent me a video. They're so floppy and they're going to be so much fun to play with. Oh my gosh. Very flexible. Which is awesome because I've always... I always told myself, like, when I get a first seat, I want floppy ears. Because playing with them just seems like it'd be so much fun. Oh my gosh. I'm going to need to brush her head a little bit. I don't quite have a brush just yet. Oh, she is gorgeous. She's got, like, a nice little lining under here almost. I guess how that's, that's how it keeps the shape of her little mohawk here. 
Look at her. She's got a little purple tongue. Oh my gosh. It's like lined on the inside a little bit too. Oh, it's just so soft and fluffy. There's like, it's like a pillow down here. Oh, that's so great. Alright. Oh. I'm gonna put her on. Got a balaclava, but uh, not too worried. I don't think I'll be wearing her for too long before uh, ending this video. Oh, I love her so much. She's so gorgeous. Alright, here we go. So you guys probably won't be able to hear me. Um, I'm yelling a little bit, so if I do end up being louder, I'm very sorry. Um, just because my voice is failing, so I want to make sure you guys hear me. Uh, oh my gosh. I can't believe this is actually happening. Oh wow. Just to make sure you guys can hear me. Lovely hair, I know. Um, the very first thing I noticed with her, she fits so very nicely. It's snug right around the bottom, um, getting in. But like after that, it just sits so nicely. Everything is super smooth, even without a balaclava. Like, I don't... There's, it's not scratchy. Um, oh my gosh. Her visibility was pretty great, despite the fact that I had my hair in my face pretty much like this. Uh, her little slanted eyeballs here made it so that I had a pretty good range of vision. There wasn't a huge blind spot. Uh, the mouth is positioned just perfectly so I can literally breathe right out of it. Um, and this is talking from experience of like other fursuits that I've worn, um, just from a friend. Uh, whose mouth wasn't quite lined up with my own, but oh my gosh, I love her so much. Oh my gosh. Since Liam, I know you'll be watching this. Thank you so much. I absolutely adore her. She's gorgeous, and I absolutely cannot wait to start wearing her around and taking pictures and debuting her at FE. I'll send you so many pictures. You're... oh... You're going to be sick of me by the end of it, I promise you that. Oh, she's so pretty. Oh, I love her so much. Alright. Before I start droning on and repeating myself, I guess that's where I'm going to uh, end the video. But oh my gosh. Let's tuck this back in here. I'm so excited. Thank you so much, Liam, for everything, for being such an absolutely great uh, person to work with. I definitely, definitely recommend his work to absolutely everybody. Need a nostrils. Sorry, I keep getting sidetracked. I'm in love. Oh my gosh, I love her so much. Oh. You guys, no matter where you're watching this, we'll definitely be seeing more of her. Thank you for watching.